Herzlich willkommen zu einem neuen Let's Play. Ich bin der Puma Chris und wir zocken heute Black Mesa. Black Mesa ist die Neuaufbereitung des 1998er Half-Life in der Source Engine 2, die bei Half-Life 2 zum Einsatz kam. Und ohne große Umschweife springen wir jetzt einfach in das Spiel. Die Einleitungssequenz werde ich mal komplett unkommentiert lassen. Lasst euch von der Atmosphäre einfach mal ein bisschen einnehmen. Und wundert euch nicht, ist eine interaktive Sequenz. Das heißt, man kann sich dort schon frei bewegen und umschauen. So, ähm, ja, ich wünsche euch viel Spaß und dann rocken wir das Ding zusammen. to the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees with an estimated high of 100 and five. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. train is inbound from level 3 dormitories to sector C test labs and control facilities. If your intended destination is a high security area beyond sector C, you will need to return to the central transit hub in area 9 and board a high security train. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing before you will be permitted into the high security branch of the transit system. toxicity of material routinely handled in the Black Mesa compound, no smoking, eating, or drinking are permitted within the Black Mesa transit system. Keep your limbs inside the train at all times. Do not attempt to open the doors until the train has come to a complete halt at the station platform. In the event of an emergency, passengers are to remain seated and await further instruction. If it is necessary to exit the train, disabled personnel should be evacuated first. Please stay away from electrified rails and proceed to an emergency station until assistance arrives.
reminder that the Black Mesa Hazard Course Decathlon will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the Level 3 facility. The semifinals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Remember, more lives than yours may depend on your fitness. who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruiting team. The Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity employer. personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. I guess his bar cat must have finally caught up with him. Put some pep in that step, Freeman. You're late enough as it is. So, damit sind wir hier auf jeden Fall erstmal angekommen. An der Sektion, in der wir arbeiten. Was mir gerade aufgefallen ist, wir haben keine Untertitel bei äh, eingestellt. Das heißt, für alle, die die ganze Sache gerne auf äh, Deutsch verfolgen würden, weil es keine deutsche Tonspur gibt, stellen wir jetzt einfach mal die deutschen Untertitel ein. Kleinen Moment. So, Einstellungen. Audio. Untertitel. Nur Dialoge, das ist okay. Griechisch nicht. Deutsch, alles klar. Wir gucken mal. Warum bist du nicht in extra Hours down at the Hazard Course? Was soll ich noch mehr tun, als flip a switch oder push a button around here? Oh man, du hast die Ponytail gekriegt. Sell out. Ja, ja. Dabei wäre ein Ponytail heute voll in. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I had a bunch of messages for you, but we had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. 
Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. So, das heißt, wir holen uns erstmal unseren Schutzanzug und dann sehen wir weiter. Ähm, ich werde hier auch noch gar nicht so viel erzählen, weil man wird hier an allen Ecken und Enden angequatscht. Ja, das heißt, wir gehen jetzt erstmal runter. But the thermal protection system seems to be online now. Those TPS reports have gotten progressively worse. Hard to find good help these days. Yes, about that. We're going to need you to come in this weekend. What? I've already made plans. Oh, don't worry. You can always attend the next convention. Du -du. You're living in the past. So. How much recognition do you think you're going to get for reproduction votes? You should focus on inventing something new and unique. He does have a point. Oh, but this is more than replication, I assure you. For one, it shows how far our field has come since the original study was published. Morning, champ. Hello. Good heavens! What the hell? You think you can fix the vending machine too, college boy? We will never hear the end of this. Yeah, you best make like an atom and split. Cause uh, that was, um, that was you know who's lunch. Ihr wissen dann Spaß denn? Hm? I'm not smug. I'm just better than you. Ist auch lustig, dass hier noch die Untertitel der Konversation angezeigt werden von. Äh, ja, weiß ich nicht, 50 Meter entfernt. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? So, Freeman, unser Spind. No toilet paper. So, da können wir noch Abhilfe schaffen. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh, thank heavens. I'm in dire need of some toilet paper. Ja, so ist ein klein bisschen Tutorial hier, ne, dass man so die ersten Sachen halt lernt, wie man interagieren kann. Da ist er, unser HEV-Suit. Schick sie da aus, schwarz-orange. Na dann mal rein. Welcome to the HEV Mark IV Protective System. For use in hazardous environment conditions. High impact reactive armor activated. Atmospheric contaminant sensors activated. Vital sign monitoring activated. Automatic medical systems engaged. Defensive weapon selection system activated. Mission level monitoring activated. Communication interface online. Have a very safe so, 1,87 groß, ne 1,82 groß, 87 Kilo schwer. Das sollte doch gehen. So, mit dem hiv zut können wir dann auch diese Energie Dinge aufheben. Ist so ein bisschen wie der Rüstungswert. Je höher, desto besser. Lebensenergie können wir dann auch wieder auffüllen. So, was gibt's hier zu gucken? Ah ja. Any ideas on the origin of that new sample? You know, you repeat yourself sometimes. So, dann gehen wir mal runter in den Bereich, wo wir eigentlich hin sollen. Wir sind mir schon ein bisschen spät. So viel kam, kam schon raus. Go right on through, sir. Looks like you're in the barrel today. Hello. Guten Morgen. Ja. 
ist auch ein mordsmäßiger Anfahrtsweg zur Arbeit, ne? Ich meine... Die werden wir sicherlich hoffentlich dann... Ja, auch wohl auf die Melinde wohnen, sonst... Ist da, glaube ich, eine Menge an Pendelei nötig, jeden Tag. Machen die Würde hier. Did you catch that last fluctuation? It's nothing to worry about. So, rote Laser an den Wänden. We should harness the remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. Double check the Brewster's plates angles and make sure these superluminescent diodes are protected from optical feedback. What's up, Doc? What's up, Doc? Doctor? Greetings and salutations, Dr. Freeman. Ah, Gordon! There you are! Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. Yep, We've schön. just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. So, wenn wir Taschen haben, bauen, dann siehst du ein bisschen besser. Last minute preparations for the new experiment. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last minute changes, they're a bit strange to just. Oh, it's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on oh. with our equipment? Oh. It was never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. <coughs> Sehr vertrauenserweckend. Dass die Sachen jetzt hier im Vorfeld schon alle explodieren, bevor wir unser Experiment durchführen. By Beckrell's ghost. The radiation level is off the charts. Gut, das war ein Strahlenschutzanzug tragen. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Hombre. Ah, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't feel... Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes. You're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Ja. <lacht> das ist auch sehr, ein sehr vertrauensvolles Gespräch, was wir gerade geführt haben. You're just postponing the inevitable. Just go on and get it over with. Testing. Testing. <coughs> Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, 
That way we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Motor start, na denn. Ab geht die Luzi. Very good. We'll take it from here. Power to stage one emitters in three, two, one. I'm seeing predictable phase arrays. Stage two emitters activating now. Uh, Gordon, we cannot predict how long the system can operate at this level, nor how long the reading will take. Uh, please, work as quickly as you can. Overhead capacitors to 105%. Uh, it's probably not a problem. Probably. But I'm showing a small discrepancy in... Well, no. It's well with an acceptable balance again. Sustaining sequence. We've just been informed that the sample is ready, Gordon. It should be coming up to you at any moment. Look to the delivery system for your specimen. Super. <lacht> Alle sehr zuversichtliche Nachrichten, die von da oben kommen. Und mal gucken, was der, was der Administrator für eine Probe hier bereitgestellt hat. Äh. So, wir sind damit in Kapitel 2. Das Experiment ist erfolgreich, unerfolgreich verlaufen. Alles ist ja ziemlich den Bach runtergegangen. Und bevor wir uns das ganze Ausmaß angucken, machen wir erstmal Pause und setzen unsere Reise in der nächsten Folge fort. Bis dahin, Tschüssikowski!